Welcome everybody to another SkySieve tutorial. Today we're going to take you through how to use the free online frame calculator which is uh, accessible on our website at skysieve.com just under the free tools tab then frame calculator. So this allows you to build uh, 2D frames, just very simple frames to get you used to the idea that the, how these structures um, work compared to trusses. Um, and I'm going to start by just adding nodes. So this is going to be the start and end of all of our members. So I'm just going to do a simple uh, frame simple frame sort of um, cantilever something like this and to, I'm just going to join the members up between these nodes so 1 to 2, 2 to 3 something very simple and I'm just going to support it at that base so support it at node 1 and I've got a few options here, I can do pinned, roller but I'm going to leave that as a fixed support and finally I'm just going to apply a, a point load just at that end of node 3 and I can put a sort of magnitude in the X and Y direction just to do something a little bit different. And you can see it's showing the resulting uh, load there. So that's been built now. I can uh, go ahead and solve that structure. And I can see my buttons turn to red on the left. So here I can see my reactions, which is telling me what my um, reactions at my supports are. And I can move these around. So I can see there's 20 kilonewton magnitude in the Y, 10 kilonewtons in the X, and then I've got a 50 kilonewton moment about Z. I can turn that off and turn on some shear diagrams. So I can scroll here. If I scroll in or scroll out, that's going to zoom. Um, and I can see what the structure is doing there. It's got a 10 kilonewton shear force here in the negative, and then a 20 kilonewton in the positive up there. Likewise, I can turn on my moment. Uh, zooming out again so I can see everything. I can also scale just by holding S and then scrolling as well so I can scale that down just to make it a bit more easy to see and then holding shift I can move that around. So there I can get my shear force, my moment uh, force and my reactions um, and I can go back and edit that structure if I want to change anything. You know, Maybe I want to move this node, uh, give it a bit of an X component and go back and solve again. Makes it quite easy to sort of iterate and uh, yeah, recalculate. Um, we've got a help button here which shows an instructional video. Otherwise, um, if you need more functionality, we do have some uh, paid options that unlock the full capacity of a structural 3D software. Um, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below or contact us at skysiv.com. Thank you.